keeping your bitcoins on your computer is problematic because it's hard to secure it. There's a private key that's in your wallet. If someone gets that key, they can get all of your bitcoins. If you lose that key, you lose access. So that key is the key to everything in the, in the Bitcoin world. What that means is that you have to you have to make sure that your computer is secure. I know some people that go so far as to um, storing their wallet on a computer that never goes online, right? Because every time you go online, you run the risk of getting a virus or getting a key logger where you know somebody's going to be able to record your keystrokes. The alternative then is to store your Bitcoins with a service or on an exchange or an online wallet. But keeping your Bitcoins with a third party is also problematic because you have to be able to trust them. The best way to keep your key safe is to limit its exposure to the internet. Keep key makes that simple. The private key is on the device and it never leaves the device. It's very hard to do the wrong thing when you're using a device like this. You plug it into your computer when you need it. When you don't need it, you take it and you put it in the safe, you put it somewhere secure. Nobody has access to your private key. The private key never leaves the device. When you get your key key, it's really easy to set up. You have to install a Chrome extension on your Chrome browser, and that's the software that allows you to initialize and send transactions with your key key. Plug the device into your computer, and it will prompt you for a name for the device, and that's so that you can distinguish between multiple devices if you have more than one. And then it's gonna ask you for a pin for the device, and that's the pin that you'll need to enter when you wanna do a transaction. And then the device is going to, one time only, tell you what your private key is so that you can write it down and store that away as a backup. Let's say I want to buy a safe on overstock.com. So I go to their website, I find the safe that I want, and I put it into my shopping cart, go through the checkout process, and one of the options there is to use bitcoins. And so when I click on that button, the Keep Key software pops up on your browser and it automatically populates the details of the transaction address that it's going to and the amount. Your keep key is going to ask for your PIN because it wants to make sure that it's really you. And so then you confirm the transaction on the device and it automatically sends the signed transaction back to the Chrome extension, which automatically broadcasts the transaction to the Bitcoin network. And a week later, your safe shows up.